Support of the Palestinian people and a fighter for human rights since the first intifada and probably before. Claire Short. My friends, those of you who have been here since 12 o'clock don't know how big this demonstration is now. It goes right to the back of the square and right back here. Birmingham is turning out and there are many people who are not here because they don't know. We could have more people. And there are demonstrations like this all over the world. The people of the world know what is wrong, what is happening in Gaza is wrong. It's a massacre, it's war crimes, it's just intolerable, it's a breach of international law. But the governments of the world, including many of the Arab governments, do not stand against it. Our own government sells arms to Palestine. Our own, I'm sorry, our own government sells arms to Israel. Your government. And the main opposition party supports that. Our own government supports Israel having privileged access to the European market so it can sell its goods here in a treaty that's got human rights conditions in it. And they're not invoked. That treaty should be taken away and Israel not allowed to bring its goods into Europe. of November. You know what's happening in Gaza is all because the people dared to vote in a free election observed by international observers from all over the world for Hamas. The minute that happened they put on the siege and the European Union and the UK government supported it. When I was there there were shortages of food, shortages of water, the sewage systems don't work, the sewage in the sea, the fishermen aren't allowed to go out, people are eating fish that's polluted, and yet they look dignified and fine. I went to the school, they didn't have paper and pens, the children were still proud and saying what they wanted to do was visit Jerusalem. They are wonderful people. I went to the tunnels. The tunnels are there to bring in food. When I was there, they were bringing in olive oil. That's how people were managing to survive. And now they want to close the tunnels so the place is a complete prison with all the buildings destroyed. Now we've got to protest about this. There will be a ceasefire, but we mustn't stop then. We've got to change the behavior of our government. Stop the arms sales. Stop the trade treaty. Absolutely insist that the Palestinians have their land according to international law. We must come back and back and back again. This time we must not stop. There will be an end to this war. We must not go away. What is happening to the Palestinians in the West Bank is that war is encircling them into prisons. Israel wants the land without the people. It's ethnic cleansing, it's slaughter, it's war crimes, and the UK government and the European Union is colluding in it, and we must change that.